episode of Aspects. So, on this episode of Aspects, I was on the YouTube or whatever. No, actually, um, Instagram. So I be, you know, search through my little Instagram, and I'm looking at everyone's products and all their clothing lines that they have, all the products lines that they um that they may have. Um, you know, just the little businesses. Not even little, honey. Wait, ever. These are big businesses, okay? <laughs> all of these businesses that all of our black people are coming up with these days, and I'm loving it. So a couple of them have caught my eye. One of them in particular is Sunny and Denby. Ta-da! Get a little close-up of that. Um, I came across these products on Instagram and I had to have it. Like after a while of me just looking and searching through each and every product she had, all the benefits of her products, all of them are, and you know me now, I'm on my natural kick. So all of them are a 100% natural, 100% natural, get into it. So I had to try it. So let's get into the products. This right here is her signature body butter. It has um, shea butter, mango butter, castor oil, coconut oil, olive oil, and vitamin E. Now y'all, honey, let me say about this. It has a, a citrusy smell to it, but it's like, it melts. Like it melts you down, child. Do you understand me? Put a little bit on my finger. It's like a, see, it just oils right up, you know? Mm, I love it. I love it. Put it everywhere. You can see your dry little hands. Put it everywhere, you know? And it real life moisturizes you. You know? You can feel the softness. Gives you a softness back. Look, brightens your tats on up, you know? Bring a little luster and shine back to you. Back to your face. All of that. Okay. Next product the hair butter now okay before i talk about the hair butter i'm going to talk about the detox clay because honey i never used a clay mask in my hair before because as you can see i have locks and i don't you know i don't like putting a lot of things in my locks because of residue and i would hate to be walking around here with a head full of black locks and white stuff so I watch what I really, you know, put into my locks or whatever. I don't play about residue at all. So I was real skeptical about this detox clay. I have heard a lot of people saying that, you know, they they detox their hair before with the clay stuff. And I just wasn't into it until I got into it, okay? Um, I mixed this with some apple cider vinegar and um, some water. Made into a paste pancake-like consistency, kind of, uh, you know, lumpy, not runny. Um, I put it in my hair. I worked it through, scalp to ends, scalp to ends. Um, I put it up in a little bowl. I'm going to put a, um, a little short video up of that or either a little clip or a picture up of that. Um, put it up, put it in a bowl, you know, and then I proceeded to get me a grocery bag and then I put it under the, um, the dryer for a little bit put my grocery bag up there, set it in the dryer for a little while. And honey, when I tell you, when it was time to take it out, you don't sit it under there for as long, well, long enough for it to get hard because you know, it's benzonite clay. It'll get rock hard on you. So um, I didn't keep it up there that long. And then the bag, it keeps the, you know, the moisture in. So it was sweaty. So it kept it, moist. it kept it, mm, what do I wanna say? It kept it to a consistency that it would not get hard. You understand what I'm saying? So it stayed, um, it was still a little, you know, mushy. I rinsed it out. After I rinsed it out, um, rinsed it out real good a couple times. Um, I wanna say two or three. Then I used this by Sunny and Dimby as well. This is her black soap shampoo. Now, honey, 
the truth, okay? <laughs> I usually use black soap in a big block, you know, and I use that for body face, all of that. Me and my children will use that. Um, I've used it in my locks before, but as I said in the beginning, I don't like using a lot of stuff in my locks because I'm scared of residue. I don't want that. I don't want to be looking crazy running around here with a head full of white stuff. Mm -mm. Okay. So, um, try to use natural stuff. So, um, but this, uh, holy grail, is real good, y'all. Um, it is a black soap shampoo. It's, um, I don't know if y'all can see it, but it's all natural. I ain't gonna spill my stuff messing with y'all. But, um, it's African black soap, herbal tea, <clears throat> xanthan gum, glycerin, and essential oils. Mm-hmm. Yes. Now, let me tell you something about this, as in all the other black soaps, even the one in the block. They don't give you a lot of suds, you know, because it's, it's a natural product. It's not going to give you too much suds. That's where the SLS comes in at, that sodium laurel, sodium laurel sulfate, the SLS. They claim that they put that in a lot of products to keep the suds of all the products. You might see a lot of SLS in a, like a bunch of um, shampoos, conditioners, laundry detergents, all types of things like that, bath soaps, um, bubble bath, stuff like that, because they claim, once again, that it's supposed to, it's an ingredient for suds. All right, it's giving people cancer. Okay. I'm not, um, don't go by this as an instruction guide now, y'all, okay? Remember that. I'll tell you one more time. Don't go by this as an instruction guide, okay? Because um, I'm just doing product by product or whatever. So next is the hair butter. Whew, I love this hair butter, y'all. It actually it does just like the body butter, butter, right name for it. It melts. It melts down on your hair like... I wouldn't like I like I keep saying y'all I would not use anything in these locks of mine that's gonna cause a lot of residue that's gonna cause a lot of heavy buildup or anything of that nature like I don't play with my locks at all so um the hair butter it's um shea butter olive oil avocado oil castor oil pumpkin seed oil black seed oil vitamin E and orange essential oils mm. yes ma'am smells great and this too melts down like the uh the body butter oil like it'll melt and oil down and let you slather it all in your hair and stuff and give you like this hair butter y'all it actually gives my hair a nice old little shine let me see can i give y'all like a little little demonstration right quick okay it shines me right on up. Shines me right on up, y'all. And I love it. I don't know if that did any justice for y'all. But, yeah, it shines me up. It does. Like, and I love it. I truly love it. Yes, Sunny and Zibby. Girl. Yes. Okay. Next product. We have the, the herbal growth oil now, y'all. Now, this herbal growth oil, it's the truth now because, to be honest, let me pick up this too while I'm talking about that. She has the intense scalp oil too. Let me get into the ingredients of the herbal oil first. It has olive oil, rosemary, neem, green tea, nettle, and horsetail. Look at the ingredients. You can actually see it at the bottom. And look, y'all. You can actually see it. Like. Like. Can y'all see it? And the intense scalp oil has olive oil and growth stimulating herbs. 
this one comes with directions on the bottle and it says use directly on affected areas and massage into scalp twice per day for best results honey since i got it i've been ODing. <laughs> every day y'all two times a day i don't play it has like a this the intense scalp oil now i'm gonna tell you something about this it has like a little a little smell to it because it has um i think onion onion skins or something in it like that but whatever it has in it honey it works because i have a little thinning i don't really want to point it out but you might see it but i don't care on one of the sides of my hair or whatever because as a youngin i used to get it shaved my my side shaved off and get the little design and or whatever shout out to isaiah park Ave. you still gonna go with the designs and stuff so i gotta cut a little too much so my hair these days i'm 34 years old honey and hair is not growing like it would be when i was a younger girl okay so this stuff since i've been doing it with the eo eo it's been you know <laughs> oh growing and stuff so like now y'all oh my goodness this leave-in conditioner and detangler from sunny and danby okay let me say what it got in it marshmallow root slippery elm bark herbal tea and essential oils so y'all i love this stuff too like i'm big on smells and stuff like that um and you know my pet peeve residue i don't play about that so but these products y'all it's just it's just knowing the fact of that they're so natural i wouldn't mind using it every day it doesn't leave the horrible residue. It doesn't leave the ridiculous buildup. You know, it doesn't wear my hair down. I like these products. I really do. Um, this leave-in conditioner and detangler, you can use this every day. Like, my locks, since using these products, though, guys, no BS, all the BS to the left, my hair is manageable. It has more luster now. It has more shine now. It has like more bounce to it. Like my locks has never been stiff, but they have been kind of hard, you know? Now it's like, it's manageable. It's bendy. Like they have their life back. It's like life is back. Like, and I really think, I think Sunny and Denby's products for this, um, like I was saying about this det um, this detangler and conditioner, leave-in conditioner, I put it on my hair, you know, dab it in, dab it in, mix my um, locks together. Then I'll go after that with my hair butter, my Sunny and Denby hair butter. And then I'll, you know, palm it, roost the ends, roost the ends, roost the ends, roost the ends. And then I'm going about with my day. But not before I put on my body butter, you know, and slather all of this melanin goodness in this body butter. And then I might dab, you know, some of my, <laughs> my intense scalp oil in there too. Um, but this right here, y'all, you, this is what I forgot to mention. You might only want to use this if you're home. Like you put this in and you throw your scarf on and you go to bed for the night, you know? Or maybe when you got off from work, you put it in and then you put some more in before you go to bed at night. But massage both of those oils into your scalp um, so you can get all of its benefits. But I done probably talked y'all to death about my Sunny and Divi products because I'm so proud of them. And I love them. And you guys will to do um, a couple months, mm, <clears throat> excuse me, y'all, a month in. After I've used these products for a month, I'm going to give y'all a video of you know my progression from using this line of products i'm not going to use anything but this line of products for the next month and a half um so i can give you the results from it and i hope that you like it and i want to give a big shout out to 
my girl, my sis, Sunny and Zenby once again. Sunny and Zenby, ladies and gentlemen. Sunny and Zenby. Go hit her up. Um, 100% all natural ingredients on every ingredient that she has. Um, I mean, on every product that she has. 100% all natural ingredients. Um, one more thing. That was all the... Um, all the products from her everything bundle but she also has other products too that's not included in the bundle that i want to get on too um which is her protein treatment i think it's her wheat protein treatment whey protein treatment something like that but yeah that i want to get that yes because i want to see how that does with my locks as well and just like any other day you guys like comment subscribe hit the notification bell so you can see when the next time i'm gonna put out a new video and it will come straight to you so you can know when i put out a new video i should say but as always and any other time y'all you have a great day and all that and thanks for tuning in with your girl